Hey guys, it's your inner chakras. Welcome back to the channel, guys. If you are new, you are welcome. I know I don't say this often, guys, but I love you guys. I do. I appreciate you for logging on, dealing up with my mess, my highs, my lows, my in-betweens. When you can't hear me, all the BS, defending me in the comments. Woosa to my peeps. All right, guys, let's get it. So this is your love life in the next 72 hours, right? We're going to do a little love, a little jingle right here, and then a jingle right here, and then a little jingle and jang. All right, guys. <laughs> and we're going to rotate this rose quartz. So each and every time, we're going to put love. Okay, here's this. This is a rose, rose quartz angel, right? We love, love. Holy Spirit, for the collective. But we're going to do a Celtic cross um, when I get to the tarot. It's going to be past, present, and future with whoever you're dealing with, right? All right, what does it look like in love, spirits, for the collectives? Oh. Give your relationship a chance. Work on this partnership, guys. Work on this partnership. Work on it, right? So give this relationship a chance. Either you're already in it or it's coming, right? Could be coming. Oh, this is your soulmate. Yes, this is your soulmate. Sometimes you don't want to believe it, but it is. That cash, cash, that cash, I, I said the cash register. The man at the at the cash register at the gas station, that's your soulmate. I know you don't want to see him as that, but you don't want to see him as your soulmate because you think he's just the attendant. What you don't know is he on 15 at those gas stations. Yes, he owns 15 of them, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So the man at the gas station that you like, girl, ain't that, yeah, nah, 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 because he pumped your gas. Yeah, he pumped his gas because his employees didn't show up that day. And he owns 15 of them, right? So yeah, that's your soulmate, guys. So give that relationship a chance. Holy Spirit, one, one more. Maybe four more. Romantic feelings. Your, your, your feelings are worth exploring, guys. Let it open. Let your freak fly, right? Just let it out for a little bit. Just let it out, then wheel it back in, right? But for real, guys, romantic feelings are involved here. And then stay optimistic about your love life. Stay optimistic about your love life. Positive thinking and faith will bring romance into your life. So, guys, don't be getting down on yourself. Like, skip to the loo, my darling. Go be happy. You know how sometimes people break up and then all of a sudden you just down and out. You don't want to do this. You don't eat. You don't breathe. You don't do anything. Don't do that. Don't do that. Go be happy. Find you. That's the time when you go find you. Right? Don't suck. All right, guys. So, what's going on? in your life right now in love the next 72 right the next 72 hours what is going to come towards you give this relationship a chance the next 72 it is saturday you may meet somebody today right especially for the singles holy spirit what do we have what's going on change is coming baby Change is coming fast. Either you're in the midst of change, pack it up and moving, or somebody else is packing up and moving from something. Can y'all see that? Those bags are packed in that car. So change is coming, either from the left or from the right. Either you're packing up and moving, or someone else is going to be packing up and moving, right? Then the next 72 hours, Holy Spirit, oh. Is somebody packing up and going to be with their lover? This change here, right? Somebody's going to a lady who works from home, right? Oh, that's a lot of us. Oh, we're in trouble. Oh, we're in trouble, guys. Uh, <laughs> it's, um, this is a lady who works for herself, right? I don't know if the lady is thinking about packing up and moving away with a new lover or a new lover is thinking about packing up and moving near you, coming to your, near you. You could be a seamstress. Maybe you make clothes or something like that. You definitely do something at your home with your hands. It could be computer work. It could be anything. It could be what I'm doing now. But you definitely use your hands, right? And you definitely work from home or you work for yourself. Well, somebody's in love with that ass, right? <laughs> somebody's in love with you, lady. A lady who works from home. 
Yeah, and whoever this person is, they can't stop thinking about you. You see your head back there in the background? And he's like, hmm. Hmm. This person can't stop thinking about you. Right? What's going on? I think this person is thinking about, oh, me, it's me, it's me, oh, Lord. Standing in the need of prayer. It's me, it's me, it's me, oh, Lord. Standing in the need of prayer. This person that's in the midst of change is a wealthy man. He's suited and booted. He clean as hell. So somebody that got a little something, right? He got a little something. Got more than me. <laughs> Probably more than you. They say wealthy. Wealthy's big. So this person is in the midst of change. They could be leaving home. They could be leaving home and going towards this person that they love here. Let's pull. Now when this wealthy man show up, Somebody's going to be sick as F. There's another man laid up in that bed. Look at that. When this wealthy man moves out and makes this move, somebody's going to be sick as F. What's going on, spirit? It's going to immediately put somebody into despair. Somebody's going to be like, what the hell just happened? What the hell just happened? A wealthy man is on the loose. <laughs> a wealthy man is on the loose. And it immediately messed up somebody's day. Like, what the hell? How'd he get out, right? Where did this come from? Where did this look come from, right? This person's like, mm. <laughs> Guys, if you're not watching today, make sure you watch today because I've been posting a lot of cards on the thing because normally because I, I know a lot of people just listen but if you want if you get a chance to watch today please do watch this video this person that rich man that's in the midst of change wants to court you somebody's in love with you and it's a wealthy man but you may already be with somebody you may already be dating right but I think when this man shows up in that Maybach <laughs> with a driver, it's <laughs> curtains. No, I'm just kidding. I don't know. They may show up. But whatever it is, when this wealthy man show up, somebody is immediately sick. Immediately sick. Immediately sick. Holy Spirit, what's going on here for the collective, guys? In the next 72 hours, you're getting a message, email, text, or something from this wealthy man. The wealthy man is going to tell you, I'm on my way. I'm coming to see you. Pick up the phone. Come outside. Meet me here. Meet me there. I have reservations here. We have dates there. I have a surprise for you here. Get dressed. Night out on the town. This is a wealthy man. You don't know what the hell is in that envelope. He hand wrote this guy. Calligraphy. And I know it's the wealthy man because look at his wrist. Right there. That's that same wrist right here. The wealthy man is right up. I'm about to call you a punk ass. <laughs> guys, I'm sorry. See, now we're friends. That's how. That's what I would have said to my friend. Like, I really went left on guys. I was about to say, this punk ass is about to call you. This punk ass is about to write you a letter, right? For real, for real. Mm. You probably don't see it coming because you're busy working. And here you are. You fell out in my lap. You the main female. You will be receiving this letter. And whatever this letter says to you, it will immediately make this man sick. Because the cards was touching. It will immediately make this man sick and put his ass in despair. The cards was like this. Let's put it in order. It will immediately make this man sick and in despair. Whatever the freak this letter says to you, it's going to be shocking. 
It's going to be shocking to you. And it's going to be shocking to whoever's in your life. I don't know if that person is your father. They have gray hair. You know, I don't know. Everybody has gray hair, right? Hell, I know my little gray hairs are popping. I can't stand it because it's on my baby's hairs. And then I was like, oh, hell to the no. I ain't ready for gray. I cover that shit up. You kidding me? I ain't ready. I ain't ready. I ain't ready. But what's funny is the younger people, they color their hair gray. And I'm like, yeah, hell no. I ain't ready. I color my hair gray when I'm like 97, 98, 99. <laughs> All right, guys. So that letter is going to shock the crap out of a few people. Let me organize these cards. Hold up. I just want to, it's too many flipped over, guys. This is a good, good reading. I, I really love it. I really hope this happens in the next 72 hours, guys. And if it does happen in the next 72 hours, or if it is happening, and I just saw 11, 11, 0, 1, comment down below. Even if it happens a week later, comment down below, because I'm going to come back to this reading just so I can read the comments, guys. If this happens, let me know, because I'm nosy, and this is beautiful. It's beautiful for you. Maybe not for the person that's going to be sad, but it's beautiful for you. Oh, my God. Didn't I just say it's going to be beautiful for you and not for the person that's going to be sad? If this wealthy man shows up, the man that's in despair immediately hits poverty because you're going to bounce. Now, I hope you bounce for love and not for wealth. Not for what this person has, what you think this person could do, where this person is living, what they can offer you, what they're driving, yada, 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 yada. Because that don't mean ish if they don't love you. And you can't be bought. So this man here who has less than this rich man, what you going to do? Because right now you love it on this person apparently because this is going to break their heart if this man shows up. Apparently, this man who's in despair, who has less than this person, not saying they don't have anything, but on these cards, they have him tattered and torn and shit in comparison to this wealthy man. Let, let me just show you. In comparison, in comparison, in comparison, this man works for him. In comparison, this man owns the building. He works for him. In comparison, this is, this person works in the mail room. This person is the CEO, is what I'm trying to say. That's the difference.